A glimpse into piety and faith, unraveling Peter Lastman's Christ and the Woman of Canaan, 1617. In the realm of religious art, few pieces encapsulate the tumultuous dance between faith, rejection, and acceptance as poignantly as Peter Lastman's masterpiece, Christ and the Woman of Canaan. Painted in 1617, this artwork is a vivid portrayal of a biblical narrative that unfolds in Matthew 15 verses 21 to 28. The painting is a harmonious blend of divine intervention and human desperation. Christ stands majestically, his divine aura accentuated by the ethereal light that seems to emanate from him. The woman of Canaan kneels before him in supplication, her faith is palpable. Lastman's adeptness at capturing emotion is evident in every brushstroke. The crowd watches with bated breath, their faces are canvases portraying awe, skepticism, hope. The Roman architecture looms large, an unyielding witness to this pivotal moment where old beliefs are challenged by new faith. In an era where religious art was not just a visual delight but also a narrative tool, Lastman's painting was revolutionary. It didn't just depict Christ's divinity but also highlighted human elements, faith's triumph over racial and cultural divides. The inclusion of metaphorical dogs is significant, they symbolize Gentiles considered unworthy of God's grace. Yet here stands the woman of Canaan, a Gentile whose unwavering faith earns Christ's favor. Last man employs alternating bands of light and shade masterfully to create perspective, separating primary figures from secondary ones. The ruinous tower behind Christ symbolizes the crumbling old law while his radiant presence heralds pure faith's dawn. The Pharisee or scribe stands apart on the right an embodiment of those clinging to outdated beliefs while true believers enter through gates on the left, marking a clear dichotomy between old traditions and new revelations. Christ and the Woman of Canaan isn't just an artwork, it's a narrative masterpiece echoing with echoes from an era where art was instrumental in conveying divine messages. Every stroke tells tales not just about divinity but humanity intertwined with it, making it one among Lastman's unforgettable contributions to religious artistry.